How's it going crew? This is Happy Days and welcome back to our Expert Tremor Mod Let's Play. In the last episode, we did quite a bit actually. We went to the ocean and made a really sweet ocean farm that got us some pirate maps. And then we fought the pirates and we lucked out and got a discount card and a lucky coin, which some of you correctly pointed out that I then forgot to use when I was buying lots of arrows and stuff. Oh man. And we've made our pixie crown ready to fight the amazing pixie queen boss but there's one little issue we need to beat a mech boss before we can fight her um, so I was just reading up on the wiki before I started recording um, even though the motherboard is a replacement for the destroyer it doesn't count as a mech boss so we actually need to fight either the twins or Skeletron Prime I'm thinking of the two I would be happy tackling Prime at the moment so what we're going to do, I promised a bit of a boss rush this episode, and that's exactly what we're going to do, guys. So we'll start with Prime Time, and maybe move straight into Pixie Queen, I suppose. So we've got a lot to do, guys. A lot of powering up's going to happen. A lot of new weapons and armor to get. So let's get started. Okay, so if we're going to be fighting a good old Skeletron Prime, we're going to have to make the summoning token. And I was actually really keen to fight the Destroyer, but you can't actually craft the Mechanical Worm uh, in the Tremor mod if you're on a Crimson World. Uh, so it only gives you the option of the um, the Mechanical Brain, unfortunately. So I don't know if one can drop randomly, but uh, that's, uh, that's okay. We'll fight Prime, that's cool. Alright, so we've got a Mechanical Skull. Let's also, because we've got some spare uh, hearts, let's make some Heart Lanterns. And then all we need to do is, yeah, I guess we'll use our normal arena. It's probably a little bit small, but I mean, we're pretty mobile. We've got wings, we've got dash, uh, we've got i arrows and mega sharks. So, yeah, we should be okay. So, let's just put a heart each side, I suppose, and that'll give us a nice bit of regen. And then all that's left is to wait for night time. I haven't done any fishing, so I've only got basic, uh, basic potions, but they should be enough. Life Force would be nice, but eh, we should be alright. Alright guys, it's starting to turn into afternoon. We'll wait for night time, and let's fight the Prime. Okay, the night time is here, and it is time to fight Prime. And the only other thing I've added is a little bit of honey. Um, I can add another one on the other side, uh, but at least we've got the nice buff. So, let's get our buffs on. Let's summon this crazy skeleton woman. Okay, let's do this. Where are ya? Where is it? Oh, there. Oh, hello. <laughs> uh, and the thing I love about Skeleton Prime is it is vulnerable to i which is absolutely fantastic. So we can just sort of, you know, chuck some i on every so often. Oh, yeah. Let's get that Prime Laser. Oh, man. Look at the damage we're doing to it. And we've got our lovely new Snowball Cannon 2, which is just great. Oh, yeah. Ouch. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's just get some i -Core. I don't want to get too crazy trying to land i shots, though. Alright, oh beautiful. Yeah! Go damage, go! <laughs> oh man, wow. Okay, I think our arena is fine for this, uh, which is nice. Alright, let's just get some eye call happening. Oh man. Alright, so where is that prime laser? I always love to take that out first, I don't like lasers. <laughs> oh man. Well, I ta actually, I take that back, I don't like the shadow beam attack of the motherboard. That was so crazy! Oh, it was out of control! <laughs> oh man. Uh, it's almost like you'd want to fight it in an area with nothing it can bounce off. Like, that would be really good. Oh, yeah, okay. There we go. Targeting that Prime Laser nicely. Um, so, I kind of like it. I realise that I've often said that, oh, I wish you could, like, alternate fire with guns and stuff. And then I realised by using a repeater, um, we can sort of have alternate fire mode by, yeah, sort of shooting the bow and then just swapping to another weapon. So that's kind of cool. I'll have to try that out more in other playthroughs. Um, so let's get some more I-Core landing. Lovely. And let's try our Snowball Cannon for a bit. Oh man, the damage is sweet. And we've got a decent uh, crit rate too, which is nice. Uh, there we go. And swapping back to Snowball Cannon. Oh yeah, okay. I think uh, the head's defense goes up. Uh, for Skeletron Prime when it spins, not down, like pre-hard mode version. Okay, I'm just wondering if we should just go straight for the head. Uh, the, the parts are easy enough to dodge, so now that the laser's gone, yeah, we could just target the head, and then the, the extremities might die just by association. Okay. 
And this is why I fought Prime instead of the Twins. Twins can be very tough sometimes. Ugh. Although, we'd probably be okay because we've gone Ranger. Uh, I think we'd be alright. Um, hopefully. <laughs> alright, we've almost got him. Alright, we're going to find out if the arms keep fighting by themselves. Alright, where are ya? Let's take him out. Uh, no. Nah. <laughs> the arms don't keep fighting. What's this? A bender head? Oh, no way! <laughs> uh, you can kiss my shiny metal something. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I love Futurama. <laughs> oh, so cool. And we got a treasure bag, which is always fun. Alright. Oh, man. Treasure. Treasure. I love treasure. You ready? Three, two, one. Boom! Okay, it's got mechanical battery and some souls of fright. I can't wait to see what sort of... Um, bottle you get from the souls. Let's see, let's see. Alright, have I got bottles? Uh, I can make some. Do you need, is it two pieces of glass for a bottle? I think it's two, or is it one? I can't, I can never tell. Alright, that'll do. And we make them at the Tinkerer's Station. Alright, let's see. Oh my gosh, what, which one is it? Bottled Soul of Fright. <gasps> Critical Strike! So you get six if you equip it, but it takes up a slot. And then two if you place it. What if... Could you do both? Can you do both? Let's try it out. Alright, so... I know I used two souls up then. I hope I don't regret that later. But, um... Yeah, I wonder if you can put one down and then equip one. That would be... What are bees doing there? That's a bit random. <laughs> oh, from the hive zombies. Alright, let's see if our uh, souls... These do anything else. Okay. Oh, man. Oh, that's that incinerator thing. Martian communicator? Oh, no way! You can actually summon the Martian probe. That's cool. That's so cool. Alright, uh, I think that's all the new stuff by the looks of it. Okay, and just Avenger emblems, as always. So while we're waiting for some Pixie Queen fun, uh, there's a lot of NPCs that could be waiting to move in. Hey, uh... No, no, don't put the candle down! What are you doing? Oh, I don't know. Um, hey, uh, Travelling Merchant, what's going on? Uh, okay... Some, yeah, some pad thai, ultra bright torches. Yeah, I don't really need any of that. <laughs> we're good, we're good. Um, yeah, I thought we probably should add a couple more rooms to our gallery. So I'm going to actually burrow down a bit more and extend some rooms. Uh, because there's like a witch NPC you can get. Uh, there's an elf. Uh, I think if you get some present that can apparently drop uh, from some of the mobs. Uh, also, you might notice I'm adding extra armors. Uh, obviously we can't do everything on camera, so I went and killed some harpies and made the harpy set, which generally you'd get pretty early in the game. So if you notice little things popping up in the, uh, gallery, yeah, so keep, keep an eye out for that. So we're gonna do a quick speed build, add some more rooms, and then when the night time is here, we can fight the Pixie Queen. Ah, what a busy building session, but we are ready with our new areas here. And I've gone just with a nice basic design, guys, and I went for a little bit of a treehouse thing. Uh, because I love treehouses and cubby houses, I think they're cool. Um, and we've got our caro up and all that good stuff, and the bender mask. So, uh, yeah, and most NPCs have filled up already, so, yeah, we had a few waiting to move in, which is kind of crazy. But, uh, yeah, so now we're ready for any new ones. And as I mentioned, too, I'd love to get the witch and the elf NPCs. I think you might need to set the computer date to, like, Christmas and Halloween, respectively. So I'll check into it some more, because, yeah, if there's, like, more content, I don't want to miss out on it. Anyway, we've got our pixie crown. Uh, you have to fight the Pixie Queen in the Hallow, and our arena's not hallowed, unfortunately, so we might just pick up some of our stuff 
and make our way to the desert because that's actually hallowed. Um, so I'm guessing that will count. Alright, so night time's almost here. We're ready for battle. Let's bring on the Pixie Queen. Alright, we're here and it's the night time. And we are ready to fight this Pixie Queen. Oh man. Oh, oh, oh. A few of you have told me to watch out for this one, so... Oh, I guess we'll just summon it and uh, hope for the best. Oh, here she is. Hello. How's it going? Okay, she's, uh... Are you gonna move or are you just gonna... Are you just gonna take the ponage? Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, okay. It's summoning stuff. Yeah, here we go. Another summoning one. <laughs> oh, okay. This is, uh... This is a bit more relaxing than the motherboard fight, that's for sure. <laughs> yeah, take that. Take that mega shark. Oh, man. I'm loving these i arrows. Uh... I'm loving that she's vulnerable to i -Core. That's beautiful. Okay, or... Oh, luckily, these little... Oh, okay. They're starting to build up, guys. These little pixies are everywhere. Oh, no! There's lots of them! <laughs> no, no, don't don't summon too many. No, no, no. Oh, let's take a few out. I wonder if they drop hearts. Oh, look at them. Tons of them. Okay, beautiful. Oh, so I think our critical strike's getting pretty high. Uh, it's over 30 now, which is good. And I actually equipped one of the... Um, I equipped one of those... Uh, the crit strike bottle um, because I thought you know uh, six critical strike that's uh, pretty decent and I just had the summoner emblem there so I was like eh, you know we don't really need that um, you know adding 10% damage to imps is not or t even if it's 15 is not a great big deal so okay well she's almost dead so this is pretty easy um, uh, I mean I don't, I don't get these bosses then then oh whoa what what was that? Ah! It's moving, and I think I'm confused. Oh no, how long? Okay, 18 seconds. I can do this, I can do this. Oh man, I hate... Oh, I'm silenced. I'm silenced, I can't use my items. Oh no. Uh, Antlion, save me. I can't use my Antlion. Oh no, I can't do anything. Oh, I can't, I can't do anything. Ah. Okay, I can shoot, I can shoot. Oh. oh man, can I use my items? Oh, thank goodness. Whoa, this thing is nuts. Ah! <laughs> oh no, I ran into it again. I'm confused again. Oh no, this is bad. This is stop chasing me, you crazy thing. Oh, oh, where is it? Where is it? You crazy. Oh, this thing is devious. Oh, actually, I quite, I like this. That's cool. Man, I can't believe I'm fighting with reverse controls. This is, uh, this is not nice. <laughs> There's this episode of Naruto I really like, and, uh, one of the. Am I confused again? Oh my god. Um, yeah, they get confused in the fight, and they have to, like, learn to fight you know, with the different movements. It was really cool. Oh man, this is... Do you know what I don't like about confusion? Like, all of a sudden your controls will go back to normal and then you'll probably just run into the boss. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh man, I love this snowball cannon. Ah! <laughs> it just like changes direction all of a sudden. Oh, oh this thing is a beast. <laughs> oh, this is so hard. <laughs> I'm not moving very fast because it's hard. Okay, my confusion wore off. All right, no, now you're gone. You are so dead. <laughs> you are so dead now. <laughs> no, I got hit again. <laughs> Stop confusing me. I'm silenced. <laughs> no, I'm not silenced. Cursed. Sorry, cursed. Oh, man, I hate cursed. <laughs> cursed and confused. Oh, man. Okay, we're back. We're back. <laughs> Why did I tough talk her? I'm like, you're so dead. And then it's just like, yeah, you can be confused again. <laughs> oh, man, this is... Okay, the confusion wore off. The confusion is off, people. Ah! <laughs> oh, my God. That's... That was a cool boss. I liked that one. That was awesome. Oh, there's your head. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> oh. That was kind of cool, like, the first form was more of that minion spam business that I'm not too keen on. Um, but the second form, that was cool. That was cool, I liked that. Oh, okay, so, treasure bag. So, this is really cool, I love new bosses treasure bags. Who knows what we're gonna get? Alright, you ready? Three, two, one, boom! <gasps> new bars! Wow, chaos bars! Oh, did we get a dev set? <laughs> and what's this? Gloriana Wrath. Cleanses infected areas. Oh wow, it's like a sword. I assume if I... Oh no, but Hallow's not infected. Okay. So if you use this on corruption, they will like fix it. Oh, do the beams even hurt? Oh, this sword is amazing. Wow. 
So not only does it hurt stuff. Okay, let's do some of the imps. I've got to try this. Okay. Hello, monsters. Oh, man, where's a monster when you need one? Come on, come on, come on. Bring it on. I want to test out this sword. Oh, we got a mummy mask. <laughs> so I think the particles coming off the sword actually injure stuff. All right, I'll settle down. All right, so these chaos bars look cool. And Devset is always fun. I'm Aaron, and I've got the Gloriana sword or whatever it's called. Ugh. Oh, guys, wow. This is the best melee weapon ever. Wow. So pretty much you're just shooting out a whole field of, yeah, area of effect attack. <laughs> wow. I love it. I love it. Okay, we've got to go check what these chaos bars do. Because if they're good, I would like to fight more pixies. Alright, let's see. What can you make with them? Ho ho ho! Crystal war ha Crystal war ham axe. So, 400% axe power! <laughs> so what, it like chops a tree in one hit? Oh man, that's too much. Crystal pickaxe. Oh wow, crystal drills. <gasps> Chaos wings! They look wicked. Okay, I would like to get those. And Chaos helmet. Helmet immune to most debuffs. So it's like an angst shield. How's the defense? 8, 11... 13, 24, 32 defense. That's not bad. Increases your life, increased wing time. That's not bad. So it gives you debuff immunity, but you don't get like damage buffs. Oh, that's a tough one, guys. That's a tough one. Like, the only bosses that seem to have debuffs is like Pixie Queen, you know? Um, oh, I kind of interested to make it, but I don't know if it's worth you know, fighting her over and over again to make the armor. So we need 22, uh, 39, 49, 53 bars. Mmm. That'd be two more Pixie Queens on average. I wouldn't mind making the wings. The wings are pretty sweet. A chain hammer. <laughs> I love all these tools. They're so cool. Yeah, I wouldn't mind making the wings. They sound pretty sweet. All right, guys, I'll sort my inventory and we'll plan our next move. Well, I guess I did promise a boss rush, so it would make sense if we get the twins uh, sorted out too. So, yep, three lenses, five, yep, beautiful. Oh, we can make a second one too, so if we get killed, which, you know, could happen, I, I find the twins one of the tougher uh, mech bosses. So if we do get killed, then at least, yeah, we can make a second one. Well, it's night time, and we're ready for our next boss, and as an ad bonus, I'll put my buffs on. <laughs> I can't believe I didn't put them on against a pixie queen. Oh, that's so crazy. Oh, man. Okay. Wow. So, I'm thinking this should go pretty well uh, with our awesome ranged weapons. Oh, yeah, that's nice, although damage is a thing. Uh, I'll have to remember that, you know, this is a proper Terraria boss, so... Yeah, they'll do the right amount of damage. <laughs> uh, unlike the corn boss. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, there's curse flames going everywhere. Whoa, okay. Oh, man. Oh, twins. <laughs> oh, at least they're vulnerable to high core. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get some uh, nice... Oh, yeah, good stuff. Okay, oh, man. It's shooting faster than I remember. <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's because I'm using different arena for this, perhaps. All right, okay, we got I core on him. Beautiful, and landing some hits. He's probably going to change soon. Soon. Oh man, that would have been a great spot for him to transform on. Oh, come on, don't do it up and high. Oh. Okay, I'm trying to uh, ignore Retinaza. Okay, there we go. He's changing, he's changing, he's changing. And, ooh, did I just get hit by Cursed Flames? Yuck. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Oh man. And this is usually the part of the fight where we go for a bit of a walk. <laughs> a bit of a walk. <laughs> Oh man, bit of a talk. <laughs> oh, okay. We've got to take out this crazy. Oh man, spasmodism. No, don't dodge on me, please. No, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Oh, and lion save me. <laughs> man, that thing is the best for a, like a quick burst run. Very useful. All right. Oh no, it's gonna hit me. Oh man, ow. Oh no. Oh, oh, ant lion. <laughs> oh man, this is so bad. Oh man. Okay, I've just got to avoid its next charge. Alright, I think, I think, I think we're good, I think we're good. Oh man, oh. Okay, we've got to take him out. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Get out of the way, Retinator! <laughs> no! Oh, no! Oh, okay, we got him. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, wow. Oh, that was, that was difficult. Oh, it should be okay now. <laughs> we should be alright. You would think. Oh man, snowball launcher, you're so good. 
Alright, let's use some Mega Shark too. Ah, very good. Alright, let's get Icor back on. Oh, so good. Ah, there we go. Ah, we're at the nice part of the fight where there's only one of them. Ah, beautiful. Okay, we've got another peel off. Very nice. And, uh, he should be transforming very soon. Yeah, there we go. Let's get some free hits in. And he's down to 9,000. Very good. I don't know why I'm saying he like it's a, it's a boy or a girl. It's just an it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, okay. Come on, come on. We can do this. We can do this. Stop shooting me. Don't sh Oh, no. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Oh, that'd be so bad. Okay, we're 30 seconds off the heel. Alright, we've just got to keep moving. Oh, man. Look at those beams. Oh, I'm out of bullets. <gasps> I'm out of bullets. No. Oh, no. No. Oh, man. This is bad. This is bad. Oh. Okay, we got it. Oh, wow. Oh, man. I don't know why I find the twins so difficult. <laughs> but we did it. <laughs> That's the main thing. Oh, the souls. The souls are probably up in the air, aren't they? Oh, man. Okay, let's go see. Did I leave the souls up in the sky? No, I don't think so. No. Did I get the souls? No, are they, are they in the treasure bag? Oh, man. I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm so confused. All right, let's open the bag. I've done this before, and you guys are like, happy you left the souls. <laughs> All right, <laughs> you ready for treasure? Three. Oh, maybe we'll get another dev set. Two. One. Boom. Okay, the souls are in the bag. Whew. Thank goodness. Okay. <laughs> and I got the water bolt out too. I remembered a lot of you were telling me to make this cool, it's a spear or something. Um, so I'd love to see it in action. Oh man. Okay. Hive zombies. Oh my gosh. All right. So we have fought some bosses. We've got this amazing new sword. Uh, this sword is going to wreck Plantera. Plantera. I'm saying it now. I think this sword is going to beast it. Like so good. Can't wait to use it. Oh man, and we've got more Hello Bars and Souls of Sight. So much to do guys, so much crafting. Let's move on to the next step. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching another episode of our Expert Tremor Let's Play. And I must admit, I did enjoy doing a bit of a boss rush this episode. And can I also add, again, I loved that Pixie Queen boss. Very well designed, very cool. The first part could probably use a bit of tweaking, but I love the second part. I thought that was so fun. Fighting confused is so tough. <laughs> love it. Love it. Uh, quick announcement too, guys. Uh, this is probably going to be the last day for voting for the next series. I'd like to get it started. Um, I'm, I'm inspired. I'm ready to jump into a new story. So it'll be a story-based series. Um, so yeah, links in the description. Uh, just pick whichever one you really want to see and uh, this is your chance to have a say in what we have on our channel. So make sure you take advantage of that. Alright, it's time for some shout outs as always. And our first one is from the Master Crobatic. And they've asked me to see in a Draco voice. Igor Snowballs? More like Igor Cookies. <laughs> no! It's more like Cookie Snowballs. <laughs> and Willy was slain. Oh no. Oh man. I messed up a shout out and poor Willy got slain. So sad. Our next one is from David Ward, who, like another user the other day, is also a long-time subscriber. I love it when, you know, people have been on the channel for a while pop in and say hi. I think it's so cool. And they've asked a question, and they would like to know, what is your favourite class in Terraria? And it's probably good if you add Y as well. So, yeah, I guess I'd, I'd answer as well. I really enjoy yo-yos, although they can be a bit linear, like you're pretty much just using the same weapon all the time. I kind of like mages too. I think they're... You know, because they have less armor, you've really got to work on your dodging and things like that. And the different spells do so many different things. Very cool. And next one is from Panda Juice Gaming. And they've asked me to see in a Draco voice. Discount card? More like discount cookie. <laughs> and they've also asked about the Let's Build series. And that's a really good point. We, uh, we've done quite a few episodes, but I haven't done an episode of that for a while. Uh, which is where this temple, this sky temple came from. So... Yeah, I'll, I'll have a play around with some designs, and uh, we might do another episode of that soon. I'd like to get back into it as well. Uh, our next one is from James Thompson. And I've asked me to say in a Draco voice, he's popular today. <laughs> What's the best ammo to use? Cookies, of course! <laughs> yeah, cookie ammo. <laughs> That'd be great. <laughs> and our last one today is from Golden One. Yes, that's right, Golden One. 
It must be seen in Felix's voice. I hope I catch a cookie fish soon. Wait, they just don't exist? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and it's really hard, like, when you're trying to get a rare item in Terraria, you start to doubt yourself. You're like, am I in the right spot? Is this actually going to drop? And uh, I've done that with the Rod of Discord a few times, and you start doubting it. Oh. <laughs> oh, guys, thanks so much for watching, as always. Click that like button, smash it with a cookie if you've enjoyed the episode, if you're still watching. And, uh, yeah, keep your comments and suggestions coming. Keep letting me know what items I should be checking out in the Tremor mod if you've already played it. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, join our crew, guys. If you're watching and you'd like to get our videos straight to your sub box, smash that subscribe button. I was going to say cookie button. <laughs> I'll change it one day. <laughs> and here's the most important part, as always. You'll stay happy, and I'll see you soon. This is Happy Day signing out. See ya. All right, now let's find out where this lava is. Mr. Lava! <gasps> oh, goodness. Okay, we've got to heal off. Nice. Oh, he's about to go in his last form. Oh, what are we... No! <laughs>